Hello everybody and welcome to another video. We're gonna take a look at another post from the guys from the devs of Ultimate Admiral Game Labs of course. They uh, posted about a week ago at the time of uh, upload, well three days ago as you can see, at the time of recording. And this is about land units. The land units which the developers have added. or are adding yeah whatever so uh, there are a few land units in uh, ultimate admiral you'll recognize some of them from uh, ultimate general and some of them you won't so uh, the first one is a militia ignore that steam in uh, the corner and uh, militia is generally well they're, they're not soldiers they're conscripts I get, not really conscripts but like just citizens of a nation, subjects of a state, just regular people given a gun and good luck. So uh, they're not really uh, strong against regular forces, but uh, they're, they're good for, uh, well, cannon fodder, I guess. Also, you can do probably use them for like flanking and such, holding the line by, uh, while holding a fort. But of course, the most important unit of any army, line infantry. So. Uh, we all know and love line infantry, the best units, well, not the best, the most common unit you will uh, probably both face and use. And uh, you'll be using them uh, in Ultimate Admiral to uh, do invasions, conduct uh, land operations, and just regular stuff like in Ultimate Admiral and Ultimate General, I mean, as well as uh, the Total War Empire and Napoleon Total War. Another one which is not an ultimate general or total war, marines and sailors. So marines, they're of course the elite uh, unit on board the ships and you have sailors. The sailors are not well suited for ground operations, but they can still do it. Sailors of course are best left to what they're good at, which would be sailing. Marines, they, are, they can do good at both. They're not sailors, their one wall is do pew pew, so they're fine either way. Sailors, not so much. Next unit we present, skirmishers. We uh, recognize them, they're just the best unit per unit. Like per person, they're the best unit, best accuracy, best range, best everything, yeah, but they're expensive and they're not as large in numbers. So uh, use them wisely. Now we go into the big guns. First one, coastal battery, pretty self-destructive. It is just a coastal battery. You can't. You can only shoot outwards with them. You can't move them around. There's little. Uh, there's little video here. Just a quick capture of uh, a coastal battery. Next up, we of course have field artillery. Also, uh, something we saw in Ultimate Ad Ultimate General. These guys have two kinds of shots. You have canister, which close range, and uh, round shot, medium, all the other ranges basically. And of course, finally, you have supply wagons and supply warehouses to uh, supply your troops, since of course the troops can run out of ammo and such. So yeah, this was a very quick overview of the land units. I'm really looking forward to the game. Soon, hopefully, it will be uh, it will be launched, or at least the, the first uh, access. Apologies, but anyways, I do hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe. Sorry about that. Really, really sorry. But anyways, I do hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe and all of that. And uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.